the key. Way of yeah. Looking at reality. I don't which think is from so. a certain end of, of a prison. I don't think so. I mean, it's funny because it's the third question I've gotten from here. I feel like the British think that they're not a part of this. But <laughs> I, I actually don't think it's extreme. I think that most people who look through the book and see the pictures and read the stories are gonna see themselves. I mean, you might not be to the point, like there's a, there's a scene in Queen of Versailles where Jackie goes into Walmart after she's lost everything and goes out with 10 carts of, um, 10 shopping carts. And I mean, I've never come out with 10 shopping carts, but I've certainly gone into a superstore and bought things that I didn't know I needed or wanted before I went in there. Um, and so I think that uh, I actually don't think there are extreme situations and there are you know, a lot of, from middle class to working class to upper class from young people who are very good at kind of mimicking or, or playing out what they see in a very honest way to old people. I mean, I, I started looking at kids growing up quickly and then realized that their parents didn't want to get older and wanted to kind of stay young forever and so that mm -hmm. took me to their parents, so I actually think that there's there's so something within, pretty identifiable to, towards the, you know, what we might call the, the main. Scene. And when you see the people in the fall section who get hurt by the crash, you really see how so many people were kind of mimicking these these the extremes, but in very um, you know middle class ways. Like there's a GM worker who loses his job in a town where GM has been the only company there for generations that his family worked for, and he has to sell his wife's tanning bed, among other things, among and also loses his house. But you know, you see how like something that you would expect to see at Jackie Stiegel's house is at um, an auto worker 